an urban area is always in transition uh, and it's going quicker and quicker. When things are changing, you have the possibility to adapt with your water system. And to have this dialogue between planners and the transition process and the water management, I think this is the real challenge. Many engineers are looking for the models, what is the right solution, planners are making nice, draw, nice drawings, uh, then there are uh, uh, social people who are doing a real, lot of interaction. But somehow, and it's our experience in the Netherlands, that these are different worlds and they are not connected and they speak a different language. And the only place where you can meet each other is in practice. And not on a distance, not at the university uh, area, not on an office. You have to meet each other in practice and then discuss the things and also with the people living there. The challenge is to bring these worlds together and make it real in practice. Our experience in the Netherlands about new administration, uh, they are quite intensive because we don't have any money anymore. This whole th that, that the government makes the rules and provides the people with money. This is not anymore. So government has to change and has not to, is not acting at, on top of the society, but in society. Uh, one of the initiatives in the Netherlands is what we call the Water Coalition, that uh, national government, local government, uh, enterprises, people, they all working together from their own point of view in reality. And then government is not the party who gives the money, no, he, they have to cooperate in a way that they cannot ask everything from people. Especially people in government, it's really difficult uh, to have an other position. It's more a network game than a hierarchical game.